I am so excited to work with Nachito this coming weekend. He is just such an incredibly dynamic artist, and I think what he brings to this concert in particular is quite special. Now, I'm a fan of Afro-Cuban music. I've listened to a lot of this stuff since I was a kid. And so I've known about Nachito Herrera for years, um, since I first came across him when he was playing with um, Cubanissimo and the Afro-Cuban All-Stars. Uh, and only recently have I gotten to know a little bit more about him as a classical player. In fact, one of the things that's really so special and unique about him is that he is able to cross uh, the lines of some of these musical genres with such skill. Uh, I mean, obviously his playing is really rhythmically focused, it's very vital, it's very colorful and exciting, but I think that applies so well when you bring it over to some of this more traditional repertoire. And in fact, uh, Rhapsody in Blue, even though it's you know one of the great pieces in the classical repertoire, is much more of a crossover type piece, full of all kinds of jazz rhythms, and there's even echoes of Chopin in there, and there's bits and pieces of Jewish music. It's, it's such an incredible amalgam of the things that made up George Gershwin's personality. And I think a lot of that same kind of amalgamation of styles is there in Nachito's work. In fact, he's told me he loves to play Gershwin for that reason. <laughs> he just loves to find all these great rhythmic nooks and crannies and unique expressive possibilities in the music of Gershwin. So I think it's going to make for an incredible fit. Uh, the other thing that's going to be very exciting about having Nachito with us is the opportunity to offer the audience a little bit of a surprise that harkens back more to his native musical style. So we're going to throw in a little bit of Cuban music onto this concert, but we're not going to announce this piece. Instead, we're just letting folks know that we've got an extra surprise with Nachito, and uh, I think folks are going to love it. Um, it's actually uh, some of my favorite Cuban music that Nachito has arranged for himself to play with orchestras, and so uh, everybody's going to be in for a real treat there. So I say this is an experience not to be missed. Um, Nachito playing Gershwin and then you know, jumping in with the orchestra and some Cuban music uh, should be incredible. This guy's musical personality is like no other. So, uh, yeah, come on out and hear us uh, create some incredible musical fireworks with Nachito Herrera this weekend, Saturday, September 21st at the Gallagher Blue Dorn.